Hi everybody. Well, I've been hard at work creating an up-to-date config file for Dr. Jones Trader, the very popular trader mod, the really cool trader mod for Daisy on PC. So I'll put a link in the description below the video to this very simple GitHub repository that contains two files. Um, and if you want to download them, just click on the code button, click on download zip, and then unzip it on your local computer. Uh, it contains a traderconfig.txt and a readme.txt. Um, and if you're familiar with Dr. Jones Trader, which you probably will be if you're watching this video, you know the traderconfig.txt text is the one that includes all the data for the items that the traders will sell, including the prices. And so what I've done is I've um, added the latest items from Daisy 1.18 into the trader config file. Um, now, the trader config.txt file that is included in this GitHub also includes the stuff from 117, 116, 115. So it's a, it's a completely up to date as far as I'm aware. Pretty sure it's got it's got everything in it. So if you've got a vanilla Dr. Jones trader setup where you're just using uh, the the vanilla prices and the vanilla items so you haven't added anything from any other mods what you could do is just take that traderconfig.txt file upload it to your trader folder in your servers profile config or settings folder um, upload that on top of the existing traderconfig.txt file save and then restart your server and you will have the um, m79 the plastic explosive the claim on the line the remote detonator the derringers and the grenade, uh, the chem gas grenade, because it's all included. Also, if you're using an old um, Dr. Jones file, because I think the one that comes included with it is really old. Um, I think, yeah, it's really, really old. So if you're using that, then um, that if you're using that file, then that will then also update it. Now, if you are using a customized trader, uh, config which you probably are if you've got other mods installed so maybe you've got like the armor weapons mod or um, one of the extra clothing mods or anything like that where you've added lots of other things in you won't want to use my uh, trader config dot tech because that will delete all that hard work you've put in what you want to do is just add in the individual things and that's what these are here um, now, what I've done is I've created a new category which you could put with the weapons trader with the M79, the weapons for the M79 and the fireworks <laughs> launcher as well. You might want to put the fireworks somewhere else. And I've created a new category for the explosives and detonator. So it's got the plastic explosive, the claymore mine and the remote de detonator for making um, IEDs and just, you know, just remote explosives. Um, so you can add those as, as new categories, including the title. Uh, these ones, though, for the Derringer and the Grenade, so the Chem, grass, chem Gas Grenade, another one that's just like a glass vial, um, there are already categories for these within Trader, so you'll just probably just want to add those. Just check the prices are kind of compatible or equivalent to what your Trader's running, and, and that's it, really. So uh, add them into your existing Trader config.txt, save, restart and then you'll get the new items at your trader so big thanks out obviously to dr jones with the amazing trader i, I love this it's one of my favorite mods this and daisy dog and red falcons helis and the daisy editor my favorite mods there's probably a few more as well <laughs> but anyway really is very very good indeed so the link to this will be in the description below the video i'll put a link to the trader mod as well just in case this video has wet your appetite to install it um, and if you've enjoyed the video, hit like, if you want to see more of the same, press subscribe, and I will of course see you again soon.